The Bozeman Fire Department held its annual ice rescue training today. MTN's Kenneth Webb finds out what the department does to prepare for this winter season. We train once a year, uh, usually at the beginning of the season when the ice is super thin and people are more apt to go through. And then we'll do a refresher at the end of the season just to refine our skills. With all the new constructions and subdivisions going up in the community, Bozeman Fire Department are wanting to be trained in case of an emergency. With the new subdivisions going up, there's more and more residential ponds in the city of Bozeman, and there's just more of a chance for people to be out recreating. Bozeman Fire Department was training for several different ice rescue scenarios. Uh, so the scenarios we're doing today, uh, we're doing anywhere from a reach rescue where we use a pike pole just to get as close to the victim as possible if they're able to reach it. Uh, throw rescue, we have uh, swift water rope bags with us that we can throw to the patient, have them wrap their arm in the rope and we will pull them out on the ice. Or if they're unable to self-extricate, we do a go rescue where we actually hook a rescuer up to a tether line with a supplemental carabiner and they go in and they actually wrap the rope around the person and then the shore tenders will pull the rescuer and victim in. According to the Bozeman Fire Department, if you are recreating on the ice, always have someone with you at all times just in case of an emergency. Reporting from Bozeman, Kenneth Webb, MTN News. Bozeman Fire Department mentioned that you should always check the ice before going out on it. Well, definitely